Sup y'all, welcome back to another video by me, Dina. OG K-pop stand since 1998. Engines. Please, please forgive me for being so absolutely late as an engine myself to sacrifice, aka eat me up by an hyphen. So, um, not to make this whole beginning a long thing because two, I mean, one, two things. One, we're not here to hear like sad shit. But two, considering the fact that my in hype and reactions are usually pretty long because I go very detailed into it, um, I don't want to make this intro part very long. But just to shorten it up, the last several months haven't been the best for me mentally. And whenever I'm not in a mental good state, like I know that I have been uploading reactions here and there, but I'm not able to do as much as I want to. And especially with groups like in Hypen where I'm, I really had to be fully focused for me to not only catch the song in my perspective, but to analyze the dance practice as I usually do as a retired dancer. Um, yeah, so when I am mentally blocked, I'm not able to give my all and I can't do that to engines. I can't do that to in Hypen. I mean, I'm still listening to it's you and me in this world. Like, okay, I know that's not the dance, but that's clearly how I groove when I hear that song. Um, I really love this maturing and hype. I will be checking out the music video first, and then I will check out the dance practice. And I think the music video, is it a performance or... I'll find out whenever I check it out. But I am checking out the one that's called the official music video. So, um, yeah, I'm excited. We gotta get more and hype and shit here, because I love the boys. So, um... Yeah, let me just go ahead and shut up and check this out. So here we go, y'all, with an hypens music video for Sacrifice, aka Eat Me Up. Boys over Dini here for a quick pause before we get things started. I would like to say an extra thanks to my Captain Jack Sparrows over on my Patreon for the extra support. Y'all literally keep my boat, aka my life, stay afloat along with the rest of the crew. Y'all are the savviest. That's got to be the best part I've ever seen. All right, let's get it. Oh, oh wow. This already gives me like a graduated give and taken. I gotta restart. What's with the uh, following of the vocals after Sunu's part just like drifting and like haunting my ears in a great way? Like if there's a such thing as being haunted and thanking them for it, this is it. Uh, let's let's restart. I won't pause anymore. It's just again. I was like, uh, graduated, give and take in here. Hi, Sunu. Goodness gracious. Okay, Jay, with this crawling. Oh, the vocals! The music. Oh my, oh! I love this! This rhythm! Oh my god! Oh! That's dramatic. Nikki! Even the sound! Like, and, and Jay. Okay, these lyrics. <gasps> Don't one. Um, I, I really like that part a lot. He sung with the, the silver. Did my voice crack? Sung Eun is doing a lot. This is dramatic. 
It's so artistic. This is so spectacular. Okay, Jay. What? Like, Nikki keeps, um, flabbergasting me? This black beating heart makes you scared of lung I love this oh 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 part. Ooh, that let go and the slow. Yeah, this is a very extremely dramatically awesome video. Artistically, lyrically, poetically. Where are we going? Oh, this is an ending. Hold on. Oh, of course, we have to have the dramatic, you know, ending effect. Before we get to the dance practice, I want to say what I want to say about sacrifice. Yeah, I, I do mean it when I say, like, I feel like it's a graduated give and taken. Give and taken, obviously, their debut song. Um, I've always, and what I loved about and hype and ever since give and taken is the dark kind of horror element aspect. I'm a big horror fan, so of course, things like that are going to be right up my alley. And, um, it's not random. It it goes with the lyrics. It goes with the concept of what they're saying, what they're suffering, what they're feeling. And the way in Hypen is performing, or like even like giving face, being engaging towards the camera, they really give like this certain kind of dramatic emotion. Like they're not just there to look good, you know, even though they look really good. Um, like Nikki, I what? Like not only does he look mature look wise. But he sounds mature. I'm like, where the hell is this deep fur voice coming from? Um, but yeah, it's a definitely a gradu graduated give and taken. And the video is so... What, did, what was the word I used? I don't naturally use... Spectacular. It's very extra. And I love it. It just gives this whole storyline feel that we typically see within Hypen. It's dramatic. The dance is so nice. With dance practices now, I usually like to separate that from the music video because I want to give myself time to really get to know the song. But luckily here, Sacrifice from the sound of it, from first listen, and also especially being an engine and being kind of somewhat familiar. I mean, because I'm and the reason why I say somewhat is because in Hypen will um, switch shit up, you know, to be like, oh, you, you think you know us. We're going to show you some versatility. But in this case with Sacrifice, it is uh, up the alley of give and take. And so I'm familiar enough with the music, the song, for me to hopefully catch a lot in the dance practice. So um, yeah, I'll be checking out the dance practice as well. And uh, with dance practices, I watch it two times in case this is your first time on my channel. The first time I don't pause, I watch for the performance effect. And second time is where I will pause and talk about the things I like. So um, first things first, first watch of the dance practice for Sacrifice with Enhypen. Here we go. This part. Yeah. extra oh that control 
This is clean. This is smooth as hell. Woo! That musicality. Oh, that, 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 that's sinking. Oh man, that combination is so satisfying. This control is awesome. Sungun is really extra. Wow, the addition. Whoa, the subtraction. <laughs> there is so much texture milking. Yes. Yes, I love that they brought that back. Okay. Honda control. I love it. <laughs> the sinking. Oh my. The, the formation change there. Ooh, following the flow of the singing. Nikki. Whoa, whoa, this control. <laughs> oh, my. I will admit, I am very stressed because I'm like, this is only my second time ever hearing the song. And even though I feel like I've captured enough of the structure of the song, I'm stressed because of the fact that I'm like, I hope I'm able to point out everything that I want to point out. There, and the reason why I separate it, or I like to separate music video and dance practice reactions now is because Sometimes I will go back and rewatch a dance practice after I filmed it and I'll be like, oh, dang it, I didn't catch that part. So that's why I like to give myself time. But the reason why I'm putting it together now is because I'm very late to sacrifice. I got to get in hype and shit up. So, um, yeah, uh, there's so much good shit here, there, as usual, within Hypen's choreography. But in Hypen, they constantly mature in the stage of their career in the levels of their skills and um, even though I say this is a graduated give and take and meaning a genre from my perspective that I've seen in hyphen it's graduated meaning they've, they're showing so much more while also giving the trademark feel that I've liked in, in hypens in the beginning so much texture this whole sinking thing a lot of the really satisfying combinations to hit either the musicality of the instrumental or a lot actually hits the flow of how they're singing and a lot of like addition and subtraction to like just keep this movement going oh gosh okay you know what i already know i'm gonna say a lot let's just get to the second time okay so yeah again another reminder this is where i will pause and talk a lot about the things I like in this choreography. And I'll have this side off so I can hear myself talking. So, okay, wish me luck. Here we go. So what I already like throughout this whole beginning, the whole beginning, not, not just this part, just this whole first, what, two, four, eight counts. Um, they're so together as a unit. One will pop out and go right back in. They move like, 
why am I thinking of an accordion? I, I, I've never played an accordion in my life, but the concept of an accordion, they're moving in and out, but making the same kind of feel together as a unit. I, I will go more into that. But like in the beginning, we had this single line and then we had the arms behind member shine moment to kind of bring this formation or just this unit alive. And it continues to become alive as it goes. See, they move in and out, they spread out. See, moving as a unit, right? But member shine right in the middle with the arms up, brought it down. And as the arms went down, it activated the members to go down. So good. Like, went from the arms up over the head to bring the members down. They all do this moving kind of coming alive thing to bring the arms back up. It's just a nice concept. Everything is very puzzle PC. Arms bringing down for that bounce and then they all do like this texture melting together, but you can still see the member shine. I think that's what I mean by just being singled out. I don't know where accordion is coming from. That's still kind of confusing me. I like that they highlight that musicality there and that part of the song still gets me. It's, it comes out of nowhere. It haunts me. There's dramatic pullback where the members are pulling them back. We have two members on the side of member shine stepping back to move along with it. See what I mean by like a unit but still highlighting a member. Wait, 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 huh? Can you see that? Damn, like, I, I didn't even realize Jade was right in the middle already because all he had to do was turn for member shine and the rest of the members went down. Gosh, it, it's so nice. Uh, I love the peripheral choreography on the sides of Jay because he's going through doing his thing, you know, living it up. And what they're doing complements what Jay's doing very well. Again, just puzzle PC. Mm -hmm. Wait, what? Uh, oh, okay. Because you hear that, 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 the musicality, right? So it's like Jay, as he pops or like moves to each of that musicality, he like almost activates two, two, two on that 3B, right? So after he does the first pop, we have the two members closest to him set. Then the second pop, we have the other members that are closest to the ones closest to him set and so forth. I didn't notice that. That's nice. And this dramaticness of he sung on the side. Lift me, lift the up. As he lifts up and you hear that ta, you see the members, the ones. Uh, so we have this action going on, right? Where he, we have, he's going to be lifted up. And then you hear that ta. And we see them popping on the ta. It's two things happening at the same time, but it's one unit. It's so good. Ta. See? Yes, dramatic. Da, da, da. Like a lot of the musicality is following the flow of their singing. This is dramatic. This is dramatic. Sung Hoon is dramatic. How many times have I said that? Yes, and the mirroring is so good. I love that crawling through thing. It feels like they're going through it. Like, yeah, it feels like they're going through a challenge being shown through choreography because we had the members creating that whole kind of arm thing and we had the member shine going through at the bottom. We're kind of like crawling through this challenge. Uh-huh. Ooh, slide. Ooh, the take my... So as a head spins, we have the members switching sides and then joining with this whole uh, hand dragging up the arm thing. That is really cool. Let's see it again. Uh, head, see? 
Uh-huh. It's so beautiful. It, the moves, this is like one of the many examples that in Hypen has shown that even the, the moves, if you look at it from a technical perspective, it looks like it's simple, right? But you really got to add feeling into it to give it that texture, to give it that feel. If you just bl- like just blankly just do the move, it doesn't give that impact. It doesn't give that emotional impact that you need for a song like Sacrifice. Let's go back. Mm-hmm. Such good control. They're so clean. So they hit that musicality and then they're about to do this whole texture thing with the hand. So there's the hand controls, brings it down. It that brings them down a level. It's really cool. Uh, again, if you if you just do like this and go ta 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 and just do the move for what it is, it doesn't give it that dramatic kind of feel of them sinking, uh, marrying with the music very well. Uh-huh. Yes, the mirroring of his song. God, I, that that combination of the moves to go with this oh 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 part is so good. Their control is so good. Like they know how to stop and be sharp but also be very smooth at the same time. it's it's so good it's gonna take me forever to even get it yes information change we go right back into that combo yes wait wait sung let me see what you did he, he almost looked like he did like an isolated point there because he stuck his arm out and he like walked to it. It, it almost felt like that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> this, I love the prep. I did notice the prep because as they're doing this whole sacrifice and they like look through, there's something very extra about the way it's done. He- you just see a different energy here. So watch. See, you see that? It's starting. Yep, for this duet. Yes, that kick. So as uh, the kick happens, you don't see as uh, the member is being kicked, and then it's not like a dramatic fast drop. It's like a very slow kind of control drop to go with the feel of the sound of the song. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes. <laughs> Yes! <laughs> it's so good. Their control here is so good. Just like control, ta, hand out, controlling the head, then dropping on the elbow for the next musicality point. The beautiful lines. And as this is happening, we have the members coming back to join. Mm. Yes, this whole thing. See, and that's what I mean by the whole addition subtraction because we had the duet, right? Then we have them being added on to this whole drinking kind of part. And then all of a sudden, the duet subtracts away. We have the addition of the next part. Woo! Like a criminal. And they, I love that whole hitting foot, the feet on the ground to activate the next move coming. Let's see it again. See? Mm-hmm. Ooh, ooh. Da, 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 like, so much texture. Yes. Yes. Da, da, da. God, so much feeling. And then bring this back, this whole challenge part. Yes, and the head spin, the switch. Da. Yes! Mm hmm. Mm hmm. <laughs> this comes 
combination stresses me out because I want to like learn it. But I know I can't get it. So I love that a lot of, okay, like you see their feet coming up, right? Their legs coming up. It's a lot of very actually isolated movements. Like you can't bring the leg up until you finish a certain move before that. But the way they move, they connect it so well that it feels like a continuous uh, combo there. But you do have your isolated stops. And this makes me think of the beginning. And it's very interesting because a lot of choreography, especially within hype, and I will talk about like member shine control, where it's like when it's a member's moment and they do something in their uh, movement that could, looks like they control the rest of the members. Versus here is reverse because even though it's member shine, we have the group almost controlling him. Which goes with this whole sacrifice, aka eat me up kind of meaning concept. See? Oh God, okay, so I am also, if y'all watch my content, y'all know that I am a big fan of silent beats or held out silent beats. And then they meet up on the beat when it comes back in. Because you really just got to know musicality and muscle memory in order to make it as smooth as what they just did here the way it unfolded like they meet i want to see it again it's just so satisfying yes and this is dramatic meltdown if you if you watch each of them they're all moving in such a different way but still very together like one doesn't stick out um differently than the others even though they're doing different things seriously that's so good I, I will say, I think my favorite meltdown here is Jung Won. You see him? It's something very dramatic by the way he does that. Mm -hmm. da, 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 da. I really do love that a lot of the musicality hits the flow. I think it makes the choreography more creative. Yes. Okay, Nikki. They really do move differently. See, like y'all see the way Sung Moon did right there. He's very loose with it. He's very graceful with it. What goes with his ice skating background? Yes. <laughs> and Hypen has uh, as um trademark as they are, meaning what makes in Hypen in Hypen, and why I became an engine in the first place. Um, it's all still there. However, from my perspective, I see them totally growing as a group because for me, what I do notice uh, pattern-wise in these idol groups, in the beginning when they debut, a lot of their performance and their dance, they're very exact to each other, like very precise, almost perfect. If I were to use the word perfect, I, I usually don't use that because art is subjective, but perfect is objective from my perspective back to the point that i was making in the beginning these idol groups especially when they debut they're very exact to each other when they move and as they grow and become a lot more confident in themselves and also in their own individual ability to add to the group ability i notice that they'll start moving differently but yet have the magic of still being able to look as one and and hypen has definitely come to that like as if they haven't already shown that it's really shown me even more now with this dance practice with this whole sacrifice eat me up era all right y'all my engines if y'all waited this freaking long for me to get to in hypen's sacrifice era i super super thank you for waiting and being patient with me again with something as detailed and awesome as this i can't not be uh mentally clear enough to be able to absorb it if i had tried to force myself to check this out whenever it came out 
at the time what, what what date did this come out it came out it came out when i was in hawaii actually my sister was getting married so yeah of course i didn't get to this and i again i just had a lot of just mental blocks but now that i'm clear enough i'm glad i was able to eat up sacrifice anyway i hope you have a great day and until the next video coming up peace